Not funny. You have to give him permission. I'm sorry, okay? I hope he hasn't been waiting too long. He's asking for permission to go to school now? That could mean that we're the same age and maybe we'll even bump into each other. What's he been wanting to do? Just the normal stuff, like go to school and use the bathroom. Ooh, what's he asking permission for? Um, he wants to go on a hike. He keeps asking me this over and over again. You are not kidnapping someone. Stop that. Were you just talking about your soulmate? <laughs> no. That's it. No more interacting with him. But mom... I said no. He sounds dangerous. This isn't fair. He was probably just kidding. He wants to come inside my house? I mean, sure. Wait, how does he know where I live? This filter is supposed to show how you look at the streets. Why do I literally look fine? This was me as a teenager. You think the filter is accurate? Stop! Stop the wedding! That prince is evil! William? He escaped? And he's lying! No, it's true, Mother. Prince Darren has been threatening me. I warned you not to speak against me. No! Her heart. Why is nothing happening? Because that was my last heart, oh, not yours. William, his last heart, it's broken. What happens when your last heart breaks? I'm pretty sure you... you die. <laughs> How could you? Mom, there has to be something that we can do for him. Elizabeth, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. Just be happy that it wasn't your heart. Arrest him. Get off of me. You should be arresting him. He took her real heart. My heart? I can give him my heart. William, where did you put my real heart? I... <sighs> William? Elizabeth? Don't speak to me. Darling, they found it. The gods found your heart. My heart? Do you think it'll work if I give it to him? I'm not sure, dear, but it's worth a try. William, I want to give you my last heart. Please wake up. Heart oh. share. <gasps> William. Elizabeth. How do you know the prince is your soulmate? Tell us. We know you can't resist. Someone told me to go find my soulmate, and after they said that, I went straight to the prince and held his hand. And what exactly did he say to you? He told me he wanted to see me again, but then his guards came and they didn't let me talk to him anymore. Of course they wouldn't let you talk to him. You're a peasant and he's a prince. Mother, you told me the prince was my soulmate. He's supposed to kiss me and break my curse, not hers. Remember, she has to do everything she's told. So we'll just tell her. You are forbidden to ever kiss the prince. No. Alina, get the door. Alina. Your Highness. I just had to see you again. I had my guards find out where you live. Listen, I need your help with my curse. My stepmother, she's controlling- Your me. Highness! Hi! Ignore her. She's our maid. Have a rich mom or a rich dad? Well, my dad left when I was eight, so I think we gotta go with rich dad. Especially because we need the money. That must be him. Hello. Dad? Huh? No offense, but I expected you to be dressed a little nicer than that. Gee, maybe it's because I'm the postman, not your dad. Sorry. I wonder what's in here. Holy. Mom. What? What is it, honey? I found you a new husband, and we're going to be set for life. Did you sign me up for a dating show? No, Mom, I picked a rich dad, and just look in this envelope. There's $2,000 in here. I know. Isn't this great, Mom? I'm going to have a dad again. Oh, honey. This letter shows he's a billionaire. He's never going to visit us. I bet you that's him. Dad! We're looking for the daughter of a billionaire. You're not their maid, right? Of course she is. Tell him you're our maid. I'm their maid. Listen, I need to speak to Alina alone. But your highness... You heard the prince, stepmother. He wants to speak to me alone. Of course. Just don't listen to a word he tells you. So you need help breaking your curse? What? Alina, listen to me. You need me to break your curse. Right, yes, my curse. You still haven't told me what it is. But it doesn't matter, because I'm almost positive I'm your soulmate. So, I should just... You are forbidden to ever kiss the prince. Oh. Okay, well, that... that hurt. I'm so sorry. 
You don't want me to kiss you? No, I didn't mean to do that. I forgot that I wasn't allowed to- Look, it's alright. Maybe we just aren't soulmates after all. Share my soulmate's hair color or share my soulmate's eye color? I mean, I just got my highlights done and I don't really want to change it, so I think I'm going to share his eye color. Here goes nothing. Oh, honey, have you looked in the mirror? No, I... <gasps> I thought they were going to give me his eye color, not just one of his eye colors. Hey girl, why are you wearing sunglasses inside? No reason. Then why won't you look me in the eyes? Come on, girl, we're besties. We're supposed to tell each other everything. There's something about me you need to know. Wait, before you tell me, I just want to say I really appreciate you wearing my clothes for me, and I don't care if you're a commoner. I, I want to be with you. Princess, the queen has been looking for you. I was just- Enough! You're coming with us. Good morning. Mother, about last night... Don't worry about it, honey. I've taken care of everything. You no longer need to wear your soulmate's clothes. Look. What did you do? Well, since the king is in charge of the system, I made a deal with him for you to marry his son. Well, that's ridiculous, and I'm not agreeing to that. Honey, the deal has already been made. The prince is on his way. What? It had to be done. No. Yes, you certainly won't be marrying your peasant soulmate. I present to you your fiancé. Hello, princess. But I... Thought that I was a peasant? I only dress like that because I don't like to get recognized. I'm sorry. It's all right. I wanted to tell you, but I'm glad to see that you love me for me. And I love you. How many words, honey? I got a hundred. Remember, you have to use them by midnight or you die. I got this. I know. I'll be fine. Ah, crap. I barely talked at all today at school. I still have fifty words left and it's almost midnight. I have an idea. This one is for the boys with the booming system. Top down AC with the cooling system. <laughs> boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 super bass. All words used. How many words today, hun? Zero? Wow, you lucky girl. Have fun. You really got zero words to use up today? Well, girl, I got a lot of words I got to use up, so you can just listen to me talk. So they all thought my score was fake. You're listening, right? Okay, good. So then my boyfriend was like, I am so sorry to do this, hun. I just can't handle all these words. Why would you do that? There is three hours till midnight. I can't use up 10,000 words. There's something you need to know about me. There is three hours until midnight. I cannot use up 10,000 words. There's something you should know. I'm not actually your mom. Am I adopted? <laughs> no, your real mom has been taken. I'm your mom's twin. Wait, what? Where is my mom? She was sent somewhere to be killed. You're lying. I'm sorry, it's because she didn't use up all her words. No. And thanks to me, you'll be taken away soon, too. My sister and I have a bad past. I'm just getting revenge. I work for the system, so if you can use up all your words by midnight, I'll let you save her. Okay, fine. Then I'll start by cussing you out, you maniacal little bit. No way you're finishing by midnight. I have a better idea. And they both lived happily ever after the end. <sighs> I still have 380 words left, and there's 20 minutes until midnight. I am sick of reading. Wait, that rap song that Daniel Radcliffe did on the Jimmy Fallon show, I can do that. Artificial amateurs aren't at all amazing. Analytically, I take that challengers, get a tune up. Universal. Zigzag zombies zoom into the zenith. Hear everything my soulmate says or taste everything my soulmate eats. The first one sounds kind of distracting, so I'll just go with the food option. Here's your coffee. Oh my gosh, thank you. Of course, sweetie. What's wrong? What was in that? Just coffee. It literally tasted like a raw egg. Soulmate was eating breakfast. Ew, gross, he has raw eggs for breakfast? <sighs> Today we'll be reading. Yes? I'm just really feeling sick right now. Go ahead and go to the bathroom. Mm. I'm pretty sure whatever he ate was straight out of a garbage can. Hey, is my lip bleeding? No, why? I started to taste blood. Oh, maybe your soulmate is a vampire. <laughs> Hey, your brother got into a fight. What? Yeah, follow me. Oh, oh. Josh, stop! What is your problem? This guy over here was hitting on you. That doesn't give you the right to do that. Get out of the way. Are you okay? Yeah, it's just my lip. We need you to come in. Are you kidding? I'm working. This takes precedence. I'm in the middle of an interrogation. This moron is giving me everything. I don't give anything. Look, you can't pull me out of this right now. Natasha. Barton's been compromised. Let me put you on hold. 
Hey, kid, want some candy? Yes! Okay, just follow me over here and I'll give you some. Ow, you're hurting my ears! Ah, oh, come on, don't be afraid. Follow me. <gasps> Get away from her! We're leaving. I told you not to talk to strangers. I'm sorry. Where's your headphones? I lost them. You what? I just bought you those. Remember, whispering is deadly. Getting ready for school? Yep. If you hear any whispering at all... I know, I know. Put on my headphones. Mom, I got this. So, prom's coming up. Yeah. I was just wondering if you... Would want to come with me to prom. That's not funny. <laughs> oh, what's wrong? Excuse me. Brianne? Hello? I'm so sorry, Miss Sanders. See me after class. I'm confiscating your headphones. Oh, but my mom said... Zip! Hand them over, you'll get them back later. I want to show you a video before you go. Hi, you're watching ASMR. Join a dating program or go to prison? I guess I'm joining a dating program. Finding you boyfriend based on your internet search no, history. That's not creepy. Ready for your date. You know Why not? I hope you don't mind paying for the bill. Yeah, sir, you can give that to her. I forgot my wallet. Ooh, excuse me. You can actually just take this and keep the change. Goodbye. Wait, what? Finding another match. Thank you. Sup, girl? Did it hurt when you fell from heaven? I'm sorry, no. Just, just no. Finding new boyfriend. Just be someone decent. Hey, I'm Damien. Hi, I'm Danielle. <laughs> you seem cold. Here, take my jacket. Thank you so much for the jacket. No problem. Wait, what's in your pocket? Cringe. Whoops. Excuse me, bruh. You're excused, and I'm not your bruh. Oh, damn. damn. Hey, babe. Oh, Mickey, you're so fine. So fine, you blow my mind. <laughs> oh, look, Madeline and Steve are flirting. I ship it. I'm getting a perfect score on my SAT. Yeah, let's make a deal. Girl, be for real. Rude. I just have to study every single day leading up until the SATs. I got this. Rose really out here trying to pep talk herself. <laughs> These big paper textbooks are not it. Shh, this is silent reading. Not me wanting to drop this class. Hey, is it weird that I think this teacher's kind of hot? Only in Ohio. Honey, I got the job I wanted. The Waffle House has found its new host. What? Thank you for the jacket. No problem. Wait, what's in your pocket? That would be my medication. Oh, I am so sorry. I, I shouldn't have even looked. It's all good. You were just being cautious. What do you do for fun? Well, I usually like to go to the park and walk my dog. I bet you and your little dog get a lot of attention on walks. Yeah, she's... How did you know I have a small dog? You just look like the type to have one. Thanks for the tea. Of course. Cheers. Cheers. Hope this isn't too forward. So what do you say? Well, it says I have 24 hours to make a decision. Don't tell me you want to wait. I mean, we've only known each other for a few hours, and I would just like to get to know you a little bit better before... before I... Shh, it's okay. I had a feeling you might say that. Let me take that drink. Finalizing your decision. You pick Damien as your boyfriend. Where am I? Please don't be anything crazy. I hope you didn't get a bad curse, honey. All right. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. I told you to clean this room, honey. I'm just so happy. Just because you're the youngest doesn't mean you don't have to clean. I get your bed. You and I, we're just not working out. I can borrow some flowers. I'm sorry. Here's some joys to play date to you. What the hell are you doing? See, this is why I'm breaking up with you. Is that your report card, honey? Let me see. Hand it over. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I need to see it. Let me tell you something.
Blair, what's on your face? I don't know. Come here. We have to cover this up right now. But why? Because it, um, it makes you look ugly. Stay here. I'm gonna go buy some makeup. Bye, Dad. I'm going to school. Not so fast. Let's see your face. Seriously? Fine, you caught me. I ran out of concealer. And whose fault is that? Dad, you know today is my birthday, and my friend bought me this cupcake. You have to cover up that mark with concealer. Can't you just buy me some? No, I have to go to work, so you're gonna stay home. Happy birthday to me. This is ridiculous. I'm going to school. People can make fun of this mark all they want. Girl, you're late! I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, your mark! I know. It's ugly. Just ignore it. No, Blair, that's the mark of the lost princess. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am, have you seen this person? Alright, thanks anyways. For the lost princess. What? <laughs> yeah, only the royals have that mark. Oh, I see what's going on here. What? You're making fun of me. I am not. I'm being serious. Save it. My dad said people would act weird when I showed them this mark. But I just didn't expect it from you. Blair, you could be in danger. Let go of me. I'm going home. You went to school? Yeah, you were right, okay? My friend made fun of my mark and started saying that I was some sort of lost princess. Lost princess, huh? Ridiculous, I know. I hope you learned your... This is the royal gods. Open the door. Go cover up your mark. But... Now, Blair, and quickly. They want to take you away. That's my daughter. See? No mark. Mm -hmm. I'm not so sure that's true. We found some makeup over here. Well, that's not Blair's because she doesn't wear makeup. Really? Well, we'll see about that. Only talking in viral TikTok sounds was really annoying. Let's hope this new curse isn't as bad. Must do everything you're... Oh, come on. I can't believe how bad your report card was. I told you I was sorry. You're still grounded for two weeks. What? Come on, how is that even fair? That's enough. Not another word from you, young lady. Stop fooling around and go to school. Why haven't you been talking at all? You've been super quiet. What? Huh? Can you just say something? Thank you so much. You are a literal lifesaver. That's such a cute squishmallow. You should just give it to me. Oh my gosh, thank you. <laughs> Actually, I, I didn't mean to give you that. Uh, just let me keep it. Okay, you can keep it. Thank you, girly. I always wanted this one. Wait here. Jillian, wait. I'll be right back. Wait, now I can't move. Talk to myself for hours Can't get cause all you wanted to do was dance I can take myself dancing Just as I suspected, she's the princess No, I'm not. Why are they saying that? They're lying to you, Blair. They just want to take you away from me The only one lying is him. He is not your real father He stole you from the kingdom he had no reason to take me. Hmm, I guess he never told you. About what? Nothing. You have powers. Powers? Yes, all the royals do. That heart symbolizes your power to heal. I'm sure your father has used it. I covered up my mark. Good, honeys. Out. Oh. Are you okay? I will be. Just give me your hand. See, you always make me feel better. This whole time, you were using me. Of course not. 
Don't listen to them. I don't feel so good. Arrest him. Don't get a step closer to me, or else I'll kill her. It's my birthday. Nobody move or I kill her. We need to cover up your mark. Nobody follows us, understand? Yes, sir, we understand. Perfect. No one can tell you're the princess now. <laughs> Time to go. You can reverse your powers. All you have to do is say it. Ow. No whispering. We're leaving. You royal guards will never find us again. Reverse my powers. Oh, Blair, what are you doing? Royals' powers can heal, but they can also kill. <sighs> and this is why you don't mess with the royals. Help the princess. Yes, ma'am. Feeling better, princess? Yes, thank you. Good, because there are some people who would like to see you. Hey, they have the same mark as... me. I can't believe it. It's you. It is my pleasure to inform you that my daughter, your princess, has returned. Stay here. Um, Julian, wait. I'll be right back. Great. Now I can't even move from this spot. Julian? What are you doing? Move out of the way! Oh my gosh, thank you. So, you're the girl that's cursed to do whatever she's told. How do you know about that? Uh, you haven't seen the tweet? Julian knew about my curse? Yeah, she tweeted it to the whole school. Now everyone's gonna try and take advantage of me. It's gonna be okay. Our curses only last for 24 hours. Tomorrow you'll get a new one. You have got to be kidding me. Hey, give me your lunch money. I know you can't resist. <laughs> give that back. Stand back and don't talk to me anymore. Slap yourself. Ah. Now, punch yourself. <laughs> Jillian, what is your problem? You should know. Don't listen to Jillian. Thanks. This whole curse thing just isn't... Want to give Jillian your curse permanently? What? <laughs> <laughs> I have to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back, guys. Okay! okay. Oh, yeah! Bye. We'll be right here. So, um... How did you meet Sarah? From school. You? Work. Yeah. So it's, uh, some weather we're having, huh? Yeah, we're having some weather. It's, I think it's gonna rain, no? No. Mm. Did you want something to drink? Oh, I, I already have one, so yeah, I'm good. But you could, you could go get one if you want. Yeah, yeah. I'll just yeah. go. Okay, yeah. yeah. Prince Daniel, will you be my valentine? Sorry, princess, I can't. Why not? My mom says I have an arranged marriage <laughs> to another princess. Prince William, are you ready for our Valentine's Day? <laughs> Princess Elizabeth! Date. It's not what it looks like. Give me back my heart. I'm sorry. I didn't realize he was with you, Princess. I'm just gonna go. Elizabeth, you only have one heart left, and if it breaks, something horrible will happen to you. No more dating. What? I'm sorry, but you don't have a good taste in men. I will be picking a husband for you. Elizabeth, meet your husband-to-be, Prince Darren. Hello. Mwah. She's beautiful. Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Blake, it said I had the option to give my curse to Julian permanently. Are you? I don't know. The option just disappeared. She did try to have you hit by a train. Yeah, but... Look, I'm just saying, after that, if I were you, I'd give that curse to her in a heartbeat. Hey, Julian. Aw, is that a new Squishmallow? Give it to me. You give that back right now. Hmm. No, I don't think I will. What is your problem with me? I know you tried to kill me on those train tracks. Maybe because I don't want you around anymore. Why? Because Blake was my boyfriend and he broke up with me because he likes you. I can't help who Blake likes and doesn't like and you should- Cover your mouth. I don't want to hear anything from you. Mm. Sorry, I can't understand. What did you just do? Give me back my Squishmallow. Now. No, why did I- I gave you my curse. Permanently. Wait, what? What can I say, Jillian? Karma. It's a real bit. Hello, Danielle. 
I hope you slept well. These are for you. I want you to know you're safe. Everything's gonna be fine. Are you crazy? <laughs> Only for you. I've been watching you. You're a stalker, aren't you? I wouldn't say that. More like I'm your biggest fan. You see, I've been following you on social media for quite some time now. And when all of us were forced to join this dating app, I made it my goal to become your perfect match. And thanks to this dating system, I'm now your boyfriend. Anyways, I'd like you to put that on. That's not happening. If you don't wear it, you don't eat. I need to switch my boyfriend. You have already picked a boyfriend, you may not change it. No, please, it is an emergency. Question, is your life currently at risk? Yes! That's all my money in my bank account. Five seconds to decide. Okay, deal. Contacting authorities now. Cheers to us, Danielle. I'm so glad you decided to wear the dress. Where are they? Where's who? You sure you're all right, miss? Danielle! Sir, stop resisting. I love you, Danielle. I'm gonna find you again. I promise. Are you ready to meet your new boyfriend? Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Mother, may I speak to you in private, please? Of course. I'm not giving him my heart. Ugh, Elizabeth, why not? Because I was getting a really creepy vibe from him. Didn't you see the way that he was smirking at me? That's what men do when they like you. Mom, no they don't. You need someone to protect your heart, and that's what he's going to do. This is my last heart, and I'm not trusting that prince with it. If she doesn't believe me, then I have no choice but to run away. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to frighten you. I'm just a commoner. And you? You're the princess. I'm realizing now I probably shouldn't have left the palace with my crown on. I see her. She's down there. They found me. What's wrong? I need you to keep my heart safe. Princess, I couldn't. Please, get her. Hello to her, but my boyfriend, the boy whose name is Edwino. I don't want him, because then him, he was no good, so I... Now, come on, what was I supposed to do? He was in town, and his two friends were so... Fine. Please take it. This is my last heart, and if it breaks, something bad will happen to you. Someone's trying to break it. I will do my best to protect your heart, princess. Get her. Run. But what about- Run! Running away from the castle, are we? Come here. I found her, your majesty. Let go of me. Elizabeth. Where is your heart? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I mean I don't know because I gave it to another man. What? What was his name? I'm not sure, mother. I didn't ask. Could I have a moment with my fiancé alone? Of course, your highness. You can play all the games you want, princess. I will marry you and I will find the man who took your heart. Look all you want. You're not going to find him. We shall see. Prince Darren, we have found him. They were too fast, princess. I'm sorry. Stupid Cupid, you're a real mean guy. I got to click your way so you can fly. I'm missing all the bits of crying shames. And I know that you're the one to blame. Set me free. Stupid Cupid, stop begging on me. Where is the princess's heart? Well, that's the thing, Prince Darren. You may have caught me, but you'll never find where I hid the princess's heart. How dare you hide my daughter's heart? My queen, I say we send him to the torture chamber. No! It's the only way to get him to talk. Mother, please. Elizabeth, Prince Darren is right. He still won't talk. We only got his name. William. Ugh. Mother, let me speak to him, please. He will tell me where my heart is. Oh my goodness, what have they done to you? I promised to keep your heart safe, and I don't break my promises. I can't let you suffer for me. But the prince that you're supposed to marry, I can tell. He is evil. I know, William. But that's my problem, not yours. Where's my heart? Finally, her heart is where it belongs. All right, Mother, Prince Darren has my heart. Now let William go. No, dear. I'm afraid I can't do that. William is going to be killed. William is going to be killed for stealing your heart and hiding it. It must be done. I told him to do it. Oh, Elizabeth, you're just trying to protect him, I know. It was such a tough decision, princess. May I speak to her alone? 
Of course, Darren. Don't be so sad. Get away from me. <laughs> we shall be married tomorrow. I will never marry you. Oh, but you will. That is, if you want William to live. Marry me tomorrow, and I'll convince your mother to let him live. And if you try anything, I will break your last heart. Do you understand? Do you accept Prince Darren as your husband? I do. Excellent. Now may I kiss the bride. Stop! That prince is evil. William? He escaped? And he's lying. It's true, mother. He's been threatening me. What? I warned you not to speak against no. me. Her heart. Why is nothing happening? Because it was my last heart, not yours. William! Ready for your curse, honey? I'm scared. <laughs> Remember, mine was just that I couldn't eat candy. And after you kiss your soulmate, your curse goes away. So, once you kissed mommy, you could eat candy? Yep. She would be so proud of you. I miss her. Me too. <gasps> you can't tell anyone about your curse. Alina, meet your new stepmother. Shake my hand. Don't just stand there. She needs to learn manners. This is my daughter, Gretel. Ooh, I love your necklace. You should just give it to me. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> well, that sucks for you. It's mine now. You're going on a business trip for five months? You'll be fine. No, you cannot leave me alone with these two bi- Stop. Hold your tongue. You were not about to call them that. Uh. Okay, let it go. Look, by the time I come back, you'll probably have met your soulmate and your curse will be broken. I highly doubt that. So, have you kissed your soulmate? No, I, I haven't. I think my soul meets the prince. I'll be kissing him soon. Good for you. So what's your curse? I'm actually not really allowed to say. Literally just say it, my gosh. I have to do everything that I'm told. Mother, did you hear that? You're joking. <laughs> hmm, pat your shoulder. <gasps> Mother, she wasn't kidding. Pull your hair. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you guys, this curse is not a joke. You can't just stop talking. From now on... You're going to do exactly as we say. Pour me some more tea. Give me a back massage. Buy us some milk and hurry. I'm back. The milk is in the fridge. What's up with you? Nothing. Alina, tell us why you're happy. Go on, speak. When I was at the market, I saw the prince, and I'm pretty sure he's my soulmate and he can break my curse. What? Hey, Mom, what's this? It shows you what your soulmate is up to, honey. What does it say? It says that, um, he wants to use the bathroom. All right, you caught me. It's because I look like this, okay? Do you have any idea how I can get my eyes back to normal? I'm pretty sure you have to meet your soulmate. But that could take literally forever. I'm just going to keep these on for now. Hey! I am so sorry. It's really hard to see with these on. But having said that, you actually have really pretty eyes. Thank you. You have really nice brown eyes, too. Well, thanks, but one is literally green right now. <laughs> uh, no, it's not. More bloopers from my chaotic filming. <gasps> I thought I could catch it. And after they say it, my eyebrow is so itchy. Okay. How long has that been on my lip? I had a freaking hair on my lip. What you said. I am so sorry. I need some love. I really don't want to share. <laughs> Why did I eat the whole thing? You stupid. Stop it. Get some help. I'm slowly starting to lose it. Hey, is everything okay? Uh, not really. My dog passed away today. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I know exactly how you're feeling. About a year ago, I lost my goldfish, Billy, and it's just been such a hard time for me trying to keep going on. And my therapist says, you know, you just got to keep swimming. Like, just keep doing what Billy couldn't. And yeah, I, I gotta go. <laughs> Uh, I really strained my wrist in volleyball today. Oh my gosh. You know, my grandma actually has arthritis, and sometimes I feel like I can feel her pain by her talking about it. Like, does my wrist feel warm? I, I feel like it's aching. My, uh, my boyfriend broke up with me today. I remember when my boyfriend broke up with me, he just ghosted me out of the blue. Granted, he wasn't really aware that he was my boyfriend. Like, 
<laughs> a couple months back, Justin Bieber started ghosting me. He wasn't responding to Wait, my I'm DMs. I'm sorry, Justin Bieber? Yeah, I mean, he never responded to my DMs, but it felt like a relationship to me. And that heartbreak hit different, you know? You're going to make it through this too. Like, it's not like as bad as your dog dying. Hi, we're looking for the daughter of a billionaire. I'm sorry, I think you have the wrong house. Mom, when to go deposit your new dad's money, be back later? Seriously, Mom? Well, I guess it's up to me to call the- Wait a minute. Cops. Don't do that. Put the phone down. How did you two get in here? You left your back door open. Well, you better stand back because I am highly trained in the art of origami. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that paper folding? I was kind of hoping you guys wouldn't know what that was. <laughs> Relax, we're your bodyguards. Your father sent us. Oh yeah? Then why was he pointing his weapon at me? I told you to put your weapon away. Whoops. Sorry, he's new. Well, your father wanted us to give you this. He also wanted us to give you this. He's gonna use it to call you. Dad? Hey, kid. It's so great we can finally see each other. I get to pick whether I'm gonna have a baby brother or a baby sister? Pick sister. But I want a baby brother. Are you the one delivering the baby? No. Then pick sister. Fine. She's here. Hi. <laughs> Shh, no, don't cry. It's okay. <laughs> Give her to me. You're holding her wrong. Hey, what are you doing? Your little sister needs toys. You're way too old for that anyways. Ready? Catch. Ow! I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit you in the eye. <laughs> My baby. What did you do to her? It was an accident. <laughs> yeah, right. You know what? Go to your room. Your sister needs a blood transfusion. What? Yes, it's a really long story, but I told them you would donate your blood. Come on, we gotta go to the hospital now. Wait! You need to donate your blood to your little sister. Come on, we have to get to the hospital now. Wait! Okay, honey, let me see your arm. Samantha! I'm sorry, I can't do it. You know I have a fear of needles. Your little sister needs your help, ma'am. We cannot force her. Maybe you want to donate? Yeah, why don't you donate your blood? After all, she's your favorite. Okay, I'll remember this. Mommy and I are going on vacation. What about me? You're staying here. You have school. We'll only be gone for two weeks or so. Two weeks? But what about food and- You can drive, and here's money for food. Now say bye, sissy. Bye, sissy. I used up all the money mom gave me for gas for school, and now I'm starving, and there's nothing to eat. Sorry you missed me. Leave a message after the beep. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Officer Bloom. Your neighbors have reported this house. Are your parents home, sweetheart? Hmm, who are your parents? Well, my parents are... Wait, dear. Actually, allow me. bippity boppity boo Daughter of Rapunzel and Flynn. Um, actually, it's Eugene. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. You'll be needing this now. What is that? Dear, this is a high school for good and evil. This is how we track your behavior. Oh. You better get to class. Hi, I'm Ruby, daughter of Snow White. It's nice to meet you, Ruby. I'm Amelia, daughter of Rapunzel. Oh, I'm a big fan of your father. Could you help me hold my books? Of course. Thank you. Hey, so question, who are all those guys over there? Amelia, those are the villain kids. Don't make eye contact. Would your hair happen to be magic, love? Oh, feisty. I'm sorry, love. I shouldn't have touched it. <laughs> What's the matter? Did you figure out who my father is? Why did my scale move towards evil? Maybe because you have a crush on a villain's son. You're going to tell the cop exactly what I say. You sure you're okay? Yeah. Everything's fine. Sissy, you wanna play? Not right now, okay? <laughs> Mommy, Sissy's being mean to me. She is. <sighs> I wasn't. I was just telling her that I didn't want to play right now. Baby, go watch Coco Melon. I'm gonna talk to Samantha. Honey? What? I got in contact with your father. No, you didn't. Yes, Samantha, I did, and he has kindly offered to let you live with him. No, Mom, I don't want to go live with him. He's expecting you. Come on, we have to go. No, I haven't talked to him in a long time. I'm not going. Fine. Samantha, dinner's ready. I'm not hungry. Well, that's not what you told the cop, now is it? You said I don't feed you, so here's your food. Is it good, Samantha? Good. Mom? Yeah? 
I, um, I don't really feel so good. Why is Sissy sleeping? Because we're going on a road trip. Let me go! Why are you doing this? The day you came to my school, I fell in love with you. You remind me of my wife. What? Yes, I haven't been the same since she passed. And unfortunately, the last girl I brought here escaped, so I think the police are after me. But this basement's pretty hidden, so I think we'll be safe. Well, I'm actually kind of thirsty, so... Do you think you could get me some water? Of course. Anything for you. I'll be right back. Bria! Elizabeth? How did you- Shh! Mom put a tracker in your phone case. Oh, I knew this guy was bad news. Don't worry, the cops are on their way. What do you think you're doing? Come here. Uh, eat peppers for you, creep! Oh, my eyes! Your principal is now in custody, okay? Don't you ever do anything like that again! I know, I'm sorry. I was just trying to help you save the house. I know, sweetheart. But we are suing that principal. I really hope we win the lawsuit. I think it's safe to say we're gonna win. Big time. <laughs> Hi, Miss Reeves. Is my daughter Sarah in trouble? No, Miss Grace, and I just wanted to speak with you about what Sarah wrote in class today. Go ahead and read that out loud. I love my mommy because she beats up bad guys. I just don't know why she would write that. Um, what is your job, Miss Grayson? Uh, come here. Get her. Ugh. I'm an accountant. Oh, well, how funny of her to write that. <laughs> she must have quite the imagination. Happy birthday, we got you something. I think I know what it is. An iPhone 4 colored pencils. pencils. Really? Honey, they're magic pencils. Right. Class, write this down. Purple power unlocked. Hey, babe, do you mind if we take a rain check on our date this week? Are you nervous? <laughs> what, what? No, of course not. Are you hiding something from me? Crap, I can't do this anymore. I cheated on you, okay? I'm sorry. I feel so bad you and your boyfriend broke up. This tells me people's emotions. You're not sad. I don't know what you're talking about. She was jealous of us. I knew it. Hey, um, where's mom? She's outside with Coco giving her a lecture about listening. Coco, when mommy says stop, you say okay. What's this? Mom, you might not want to talk to her right now. But you still had to say, okay, mom. I did you, I love you, too. Bye. Shit, the girls are going to be home in ten minutes. They can't see me dressed like this. Hi, girls. Do you want a cookie? Yeah. Mm. You really thought you could hide from us. Let me see your arm. This won't hurt a bit. Since you're one of the last fairies, we need to do research on your blood. Uh, don't be such a baby. Doctor, I think you may have taken too much blood. Let me see. She still has a pulse. She's fine. We need the pixie dust from her blood. Time to wake up. I feel really weak. That's because all your pixie dust is now in this necklace. You'll be dead soon. What? Yes, I'm afraid we've drained all your power. And fairies can't survive without their pixie dust. I'm sorry, dear. I can't hear you. <laughs> Dad? Uh, I had a feeling they would take you. It will be okay. I'm going to get you out of here. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You are the reason there's no more fairies left in this school. Wait! Oh. Quickly, take off that necklace. Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna! Mommy, what's this? You can either be dating or married at 20. Oh, well, I want to be married. That's very young. I know, but I want to be just like Cinderella and marry my Prince Charming. I'm definitely going to have to set up an arranged marriage for her. Mommy, this just came on my finger and it's not coming off. That's what happens when you pick the married option. You may not remove the bandage until you turn 20 years old. Talk to any cute princess tonight? No, ever since this appeared on me, no princess will talk to me. Dang. They're probably just afraid of marriage. Yeah, I guess. If they won't talk to you, that's their loss. Thanks. Wait, you have one of these too. Oh, yeah. How did I never notice that? 
I guess since I'm a guard, you just don't pay attention to me. <laughs> you can remove your band-aid. I know. I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prints I get. Glee, take off that necklace. Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna? Oh. Please, Vork. Darling, are you alright? Yes, thank you. Of course, darling. I will always protect you. I'm sorry I'm not your real dad. Even though we might not be related by blood, you're always gonna be my dad. Oh, darling, thank you. I love you so much, Luna. I love you too. Well, I think it's time we leave this place. I know somewhere safe we can hide away and live. Red alert! What do we do? Well, we both have wings. Oh, yeah! Let's fly. Come on, let's go. Happy birthday! You can take your band-aid off! I know, I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prints I get. Remember, it'll be their first initial. It's an S. But wait, I don't know any princes whose names start with the letter S. Good thing I made an arrangement. What kind of an arrangement? Marriage, of course. I found you a very handsome prince. Does his name start with the letter S? Well, no. Then he's not my soulmate. Happy birthday, Violet. What's wrong? My mom. She's forcing me to get married tomorrow. To someone who's not your soulmate? Yeah, Sam, maybe you can talk to her. She thinks really highly of you. I mean, I'm just a guard, but I'll see what I can do. Wait a minute. Sam? S? He could be my soulmate. Sorry, your mom didn't listen. Never mind that. Sam, when do you get to remove your bandage? Actually, my birthday is tomorrow. No, you need to remove it right now. Huh? Why right now? Because I think you and I might be soulmate. No way. Sissy, I'm scared. Hey, it's okay. I know this vacation home is a little creepy, but mom and dad will be back home from their party soon. And besides, my danger meter, it's only at 2%, so we're good. <laughs> Sissy, I'm gonna do a trick. Are you watching? Uh-huh. Yeah, good job. I'm almost at the top. Millie, get down from there right now. <laughs> Millie, I'm serious. Okay, I'm coming. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. <laughs> Crap, my phone is dead. My arm is hurting. You know what? I saw a hospital down the street. I'll just take you to it. We think her arm might be broken, so we're going to take her for some x-rays. No, I don't want to. It's okay. I'll be right here waiting for you when you get out. It'll be very quick, sweetheart. Come on. Okay. Hey, I've been waiting like 45 minutes for my sister to be done with x-rays. What's taking so long? We're not doing x-rays today. Our machine's under maintenance. Wait, what? Then where do they take my sister? I'm not sure what you're talking about. You made it! You look so cute! Thanks! Wait, who are you supposed to be, though? I'm... She looks like the girl from James Bond, right? Oh, I get it. You know, I didn't think you were coming. Where were you? You need to get out of there now. Yeah, I'm trying. You need to use your laser ring. Didn't Director Johnson say that was just a prototype? Yes, but it's your only option, Agent 22. Now use it. That was hot. Well, you're free, aren't you? And if you hurry, you might make it to that Halloween party of yours. I just, uh, got a little, you know, tied up at work. I think you and I might be soulmates. No way. Please, just take off the bandage. Violet, I can't. It won't come off until I turn 20. All right, fine. But you better tell me first thing in the morning. I promise. I will. Your future husband has arrived. Actually, Mom, I really need to speak to Sam. Nonsense! You must not keep the prince waiting. Now come on. Hello, princess. Is that an S on your finger? Yes, it's the first letter of my soulmate's name. Well, just so you know, when we're married, I will have that removed. It's literally ingrained on my finger. Then I guess you'll be losing that finger. <gasps> Mom, I am not marrying that prince. He is evil. What? Your guard, Sam, he's... He's what? He's dead, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. Sam can't be dead. I just talked to him the other day. I need to see him. The other guards found him unresponsive this morning. I'll take you to him, sweetheart. Sam. Please, give me a moment alone with him. Of course, Violet. Sam, how could this happen? He had a V. He was my soulmate. You were so nice to me. I will never forget you. Oh, darling, you look so beautiful. You did choose to get married at 20, and now you get to finally marry your prince. I don't care. Do you take Prince Daniel to be your husband? I... Violet, wait! Please, stop the wedding. Sam? You're alive? Yes, you you won't believe what happened. Ash, what's above my head? It's a love meter. It tells you how much people love you. 
Wow, girl, you really love me. Of course I do, bestie. Hey, Mom. Hi, hun. How was your day at school today? Why don't you love me? Excuse me? What are you talking about? I knew I was your least favorite child. I bet you aren't even my real mom. Are you okay, babe? No, I found out that my mom doesn't even love me. Aw, oh, baby, who couldn't love you? Apparently you. The meter shows 1%. Well, yeah, because it's... Just leave me alone. You're literally the only person who still loves me, Ashley. Ugh, bestie, I'm so sorry. Here, have some water. Thanks. Hey, Ash. She is so stupid. I told her the hate meter is a love meter. <laughs> when she drinks that water, her boyfriend is mine. Sam, you're alive? Yes, you, you won't believe what happened. Your mom, she poisoned me with a sleeping potion. What? But somehow, the spell was broken. True love's kiss. Mom, how could you? I... You said you wanted to marry a prince. Oh, so you two were plotting together. Well, we couldn't let you marry that scum, now could we? See, the thing is, Daniel, I'd rather marry a guard than a selfish, cowardly prince. I was wrong, darling. Please forgive me. Then let me marry Sam. And maybe we can talk about forgiveness. Yes, Violet, you have my blessing. Well, then what about me? You? You wanted to have my finger removed. Oh, yes, I did say that. <laughs> did he really say that, Violet? You know, as the princess's guard, it's my job to protect her from harm. Oh, please, you don't scare me. <laughs> really? Because you look a little scared to me, Daniel. I suggest you run now. Yes, sir. I've been meaning to ask you this for a long time. Violet, will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> I always had a feeling you and I were soulmates, Violet. Sorry you didn't get your Prince Charming. It's okay. I got something better. It's what my dad would want. You picked the Prince, right? Of course. Good, because I'm not having you marry a pirate. They can't be trusted. Dad was a pirate, and you married him. We don't speak of your father. You know that. Marianne, why do you have the pirate's mark? I don't know. Girl, don't lie to me. All right, fine, I picked the pirate, but I don't know why everyone is so afraid of them. They seem kind of cool. I don't think I can be friends with you. What? Why? Because I'm not going to be associated with someone who wants to marry a pirate. They're dangerous, and now that you have that mark, they're going to come for you. Mom, I'm home. Mom? <laughs> Hello. We're looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. This just in, scientist Shepard White claims his drink smile will cure your stress. A drink that cures stress? Yeah, right. Did you hear about that drink? The one that's supposed to cure your stress? Come on, Lily, it's a hoax. People say it really works. I think we'll pass. Oh, hey you. Are you ready for that algebra test? Not gonna lie, I was up all night on TikTok, so no. <laughs> Attention class, as you may or may not know, new laws have been put into place. Starting tomorrow, everyone will be required to drink one cup of Smile before entering the classroom. Wait, they can't make us do that, right? Next, what's your number? Number 16. All right, and here's your smile for the day. <sighs> Riley, stop! Don't drink that! Babe, what are you doing? That drink. It's a lie. It's doing something to us. That's enough. Oh. Finish your smile. Get him out of here. Let me see a cup. All right, how do you feel? I feel great. Looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. I don't think that's... The captain wasn't asking. I knew it. I could sense her mark. Take her to the ship, boys. Yes, Captain. Wait, what? Welcome aboard the ship, the Blue Pearl. Legend says when you touch your soulmate, your mark will disappear. So let's see which one of us gets to marry you. Raise your sword if you think the girl is your soulmate. All right, make a line. Hello, miss. Let's see if it's me. Ah, but that's all of us. What about him? Father, do you think I could try? I told you to stay below deck. Ignore my son. He's no pirate. Wait, where'd you get that necklace? My father? Captain, doesn't that look just like the one that the... The Pirate King had. Tell me, what is your father's name? You know what? I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost pirate princess.
I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost pirate princess. My father was a pirate, but he wasn't a king. Why do you speak of him in past tense? Because he's dead. Who told you that? My mother. I see. So she was the sea witch who took you away. Don't call her that. She said she wanted to protect me from him. No, your father wanted you to have a royal life. And she wanted you to have a normal one. At least that's what he told me. Wait a minute, you knew my father? Yes, we were great friends. Why don't I take you to him? You would do that? Of course. After all, you are royal blood. Princess, you have to get off the ship. Right now. What? Why? Because my father lied to you. He's not taking you to see your father, him, and all the other crewmates. They're cursed. The only way to break the curse is to sacrifice a royal. He wants to kill me. I want to help you, but we have to jump off the ship. Your mark, it's gone. That means I'm your... Well, soulmates. I don't even know your name. Oh, right. My name is William. I have a canoe we can escape. Not so fast. You take my son. I'll take the girl. No! William! Where are we? We're on Skull Island, Princess. In the exact spot we were all cursed. How much of my blood do you need? To break the curse, we need all of it. Father, no! You stay away from my daughter. Dad? I told you he was alive. Take all of his crewmates into custody. Turn around. Wait, I was trying to help her! No, wait. Spare him, please. That's my soulmate. Gods, leave him. Yes, Your Majesty. Dad, I thought that you were dead. How did you find me? I gave you that necklace for a reason, love. It's a tracker. I see you chose to remain a princess. Well, Marianne, would you still like to marry a pirate? Yes. How would you like to be married? My soulmate controls my hand or my clothes. I've heard some weird stories about people who chose hands, so I'm gonna go with clothes. Please pick me something good. A party dress? I have school today, so there's no way I'm wearing... This is some sort of joke, right? I'm not wearing this to school. Why isn't it coming off? You may not remove their outfit. Hey guys, look at what this girl is wearing. Sweetie, prom's not till next month. <laughs> that is not school appropriate. Detention. But I didn't choose to wear this. My soulmate made me. Too bad. Excuse me, are you okay? I'm so mad at my soulmate. I can't take this outfit off and I already got detention for it. And I'm freezing. Here, take my jacket. Thanks. What clothes would you want your soulmate to pick for you? I don't know, like jeans and a t-shirt. Today I swear he better not... Those are the clothes that I told to that guy. Okay. I don't know your name. Well, I can't say it. How about a game of charades? Yes, let's play it. Two words. Right. Second word. Drink. No. Beverage. No. Wine. No. Juice. Yes. Okay. First word. Okay. Bug. No. Yes. Oh, no. You yes. feel juice. Well, I'm impressed. And all you gotta do is say my name three times. Three times in a row. It must be spoken unbroken. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Go. Feel juice. Daddy, what is that? That's your likeness score. From now on, every time someone likes you, your score will go up. And when you reach 100%, you get to meet your soulmate. Wow. Snow, meet my new wife. Hi. Aw, oh, hello. Daddy, I thought you said when people like me, my score will go up, not down. I don't think she likes me. Of course I do. There just must be a glitch. Oh, the king's passing was so unexpected. Princess, I brought you a rose for your loss. Thank you. It's lovely. Where is my rose? It was a loss for me as well. He was my husband. I'm so sorry. I was just thinking of the princess, your majesty. Snow? Yes? I just noticed your percentage has been going up a lot lately. And father said that when I reach 100%, I'll be able to meet my soulmate. <laughs> no, that won't happen. Why? Because, dear, it's not meant to be for you. In fact, follow me. Let me show you something. Here, you need to see this. A book? It's a magic book. Now open it and see why you can't meet your soulmate. Read the words. Magic book in my hand. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? The queen is the most liked. Her score is 
You see, dear, as queen I have a reputation to uphold. It was very hard for me to get to eighty percent, and I can't have you surpass me. But why can't we both reach a hundred percent? No, it's either me or no one. From now on, you will no longer be allowed to leave this castle. But I promised the village kids that I would bring them toys today. So your likeness score can go up? I don't think so. I'm not going to break my promise. Thank you. And one for you. Thank you, princess. Wow, that was very kind of you, princess. Are those your guards? There she is. Get her. You have left the castle without permission, princess. I'm sorry. The queen orders you back now. Uh, don't hold her like that. Wait. My queen, we have found her. You directly disobeyed me. I'm sorry, I... Silence. Look at your score. I didn't mean for that to happen. Your percentage is higher than mine. Shall I still take her into the woods, my queen? Yes, and make sure she doesn't return. Mm. I'll make it quick. No, please. Quiet. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Think about my father. What would he want you to do? The king would be so disappointed in me. I can't kill you, princess. You must leave here and never come back. But... Run, now! <sighs> hey, Shu, get out of here! Why are you out in these woods alone? It's a long story, but my blouse, it's stuck in the vines. Don't worry, my dear. I will set you free. Come with me. It's not safe here. Son! Dad, where were... You. I just found this girl. Dad, this is the princess. Are you okay? Yes, but the queen, she's trying to have me killed. Why? I can't believe this is all because she's jealous of you. You can stay here with us as long as you need, princess. Our cabin is safe. Thank you so much. Of course. Here's an extra pillow in case you need it tonight. Thank you. I don't think I caught your name. Right. How rude of me. My name is Zachary, princess. Well, I appreciate your help, Zachary. <laughs> Good morning, my dear. My son and I are off to go hunting. We'll be gone for a few hours. While we're gone, do not open that door to anyone. I promise I won't. How did you get in here? Go. Be free. I guess the likeness score works on animals, too. Now that I'm at 100%, I get to meet my soulmate. That must be him.